Hey everybody, Tim here. What's going on? Welcome to the channel. We're going to be checking out some John Petrucci today. We are going to be listening to The Way Things Fall off of his new solo release, Terminal Velocity. I checked out the title track off of the album. I really enjoyed it. Classic John Petrucci, very melodic, very fast. Um, had a super cool groove to it, not over the top technical, but definitely still very, very, very impressive. I'm excited for this. We're going to jump into it in just a sec, but real quick, just a reminder, I started the new channel, Out Loud Reactions. Um, over there this week, we're going to have a little bit of Nightwish and some Rush. So go over to that channel, hit subscribe, hit the bell so you get the notifications and stuff, because starting next week, all the reactions are going to be over on that channel. The reason for starting another channel is just so that we can have a reaction exclusive channel and then have this channel just be for music. I've been writing a ton of stuff. Kimmy and I have been working on some stuff, but we just haven't been able to post it just because we've been focusing on the reactions and just the timing of everything and trying to work it all into one channel was just kind of um, not exactly what we wanted to do, but with two channels, we can just put energy in both places and feel like we can really do what we want to do and deliver what you guys want to see. So the new channel, Out Loud Reactions, you guys, I'll have a link to it in the comments in the description. Go on over there if you like. Hit subscribe. Hit the bell. Let me know what you'd like to see. All right, here we go. We are going to jump right on into this with The Way Things Fall from John Petrucci. <laughs> Petrucci, big intervals. drums and the bass in unison There's like six guitars going. <laughs>
Oh yes. Oh yeah, it reminds me a tiny bit of damage control. I'm loving it. like Satch, big fat tone. guys I love John Petrucci and I've been holding off on listening to some of this album because I wanted to do reactions to it I need to say so before I start talking about John I got to say the rhythm section's just awesome the way that the the bass was grooving with the guitar and they're just playing in unison absolutely awesome the drums so killer I just the the sound and the playing, the technicality of it, everything just works. Now, this is like classic John Petrucci. It has a lot of changes in the song, tempo changes, key changes, um, totally just kind of all over the place with, you know, different feels. It's like, you know, are you listening to metal or are you listening to jazz or blues or and you're just listening to John Petrucci, so probably all of those things. Um, 
listening to this with headphones on, it's this is just like the best way to listen to new stuff because you hear the separation, you can hear the the double tracking or quad tracking or however many tracks it is. It's just layers. It's phenomenal. Now this has a very John Petrucci thing. Um, my mom describes it in my music. My mom describes it as a happy sad song. It's where I'm playing like in a major key or whatever, but it has a kind of like melancholy type feel to it, but it's kind of upbeat. You don't really know where your emotions are going with it. Now, I do not sound like John Petrucci, but the the concept is the same. And so, yeah, I was getting that sort of like happy, sad uh, feeling from this song. And of course, this is just classic John Petrucci. There's awesome riffs. There is very fast alternate picking which he, in in my opinion, he is the master of alternate picking. When you, like, you hear his pick flutter on the strings, and I said that in the last video, the you know, the first track off of this album that I listened to, you can just hear, like, his pickups are so hot and his tone is just so killer. You're hearing, like, the pick fluttering on the strings when he picks so fast. It's amazing. But the thing that I love about Petrucci is that he doesn't just play, you know, your typical scale patterns and and do intervals, you know, like a one, two, a three, or one, two, a five, or whatever. He is all over the place. He doesn't do the typical just kind of, it doesn't feel like he's running scales or running patterns or just being a tape recorder. It feels like he's being just very deliberate and very intentional with his notes, which of course he is. And the way that he remembers all of this stuff, it's amazing. It's just absolutely incredible. His playing is so good. And you can tell that his musical knowledge is just off the charts. And you see that in all of their stuff. I mean, when I listen to John Petrucci, I'm like, this guy just gets it. You know, and you guys don't need me to tell you that. And his solo stuff showcases that so well. The beginning of the song was awesome. Totally reminded me of Rush. Totally hear that influence with the the drums, his chord structure, all of it. The way that it started. I'm like, man, this this feels a lot like some of the Rush stuff that I've heard. I love it. It's that really big, lots of cool chords, drum fills. It's awesome. This album is sweet, you guys. Let me know what your favorite track off of it is. I'll probably just end up reacting to every song off of the album because I love John Petrucci and I really enjoyed this song. It's so cool to hear stuff from John Petrucci again. It's been so long since Suspended Animation, and so this is just really refreshing. Now, if there are heavier songs on the album, please let me know what those are, because I especially love super heavy John Petrucci. Like I said, this kind of had that upbeat, make you feel good at times parts, and Oh, and that one part sounded seriously so much like Joe Satriani. It was unbelievable. And then he even did the um, the hybrid picking, you know, on the adjacent strings type of thing. The old Billy Gibbons, like, blues type of deal. It's so hot. Dude is on fire, and his tone is out of this world. Anyway, you guys, thank you for watching. Let me know what songs I should check out. If there are other guitar players that I should check out or other bands, let me know. Don't forget to check out Out Loud Reactions and subscribe to that channel, please. And also leave me a comment there if you would. Let me know what you want to see. Thank you so much for watching, you guys. I hope to see you in future videos. I am Tim. This has been an Out Loud Reaction.